stuff. I feel crusty. I'm missing nails. I haven't shaved in like two weeks. I haven't washed my hair in 10 days at this point. I'm a mess. You get the point. So in this video, I'm gonna take you to a journey. So I'm gonna wax and shave. I'm gonna do my nails because they are a mess. I'm gonna do my hair because I haven't done anything for my hair for the past two weeks. From head to toe, I am gonna try to glow up myself. Now the summer just started. The reason I haven't been able to take care of myself for the past two weeks is because my husband has been sick. When men get sick, they're so useless. I don't get it. I love my husband, okay? But he just becomes completely useless. I'm always like, so Something else, your majesty. <laughs> this is literally me all the time. When I get sick, you know what I get? A kiss in the head and they're there. You know, we're always hanging out here where I poop. <laughs> what I'm gonna do is to put some treatment on my hair. My hair is so gross. Oh, I'm gonna go in with Ser 100. It's only $7 and it's supposed to be very similar to Olaplex, the bottom treatment. And the reason I'm using this product is because Olaplex, you know? With this protein treatment, I need to shampoo first. I don't wanna show you how I wash my hair because we have done it a lot of times, right? I'm not saying it's enough times. Today, I'm gonna give you a break. I got another baby skull shampoo. I really like this product. never forget to tangle my hair before washing or anything, but I did this time. I'm sorry. I know I shouldn't. It's like not me, <laughs> but I like it. If you ever going to detangle your hair when it's wet, at least have conditioner or a type of creamy treatment like this. Hair glides easily and it doesn't break when it's wet if you wanna brush it. Gross. In summer, I usually wax my bikini area. Mm -hmm. This is the wax strips that I'm gonna be using. They're really good. They hurt you the same way any wax hurts you. Mm -hmm. It's about time. <laughs> First, before you wax, you need to like clean your skin so it doesn't have oil or creams or stuff like that on the skin before you wax. sounds painful. I find the waxing my bikini area is easier standing. Ooh, ooh. I try laying on the bed. I, no, it was not good, okay? You just stand on your ground one and act like a full grown-up woman and just rip it off, okay? Three. Big girls don't cry. We actually remodeled this bathroom for you guys, for the YouTube videos. The entire time while we were remodeling the bathroom, I was like, I'm gonna vlog about it. Never do it. I'm just like not good at blogging. When I look at other people doing blogs, their blogs are so like fun. They have like such a fun life. But I don't have any of that stuff, okay? I wake up. I'm uh, wondering where I am, if I'm in Costa Rica or in the United States. <laughs> Anyways, I am gonna use this beloved champagne grapes and rose. This is a bath bomb. So I'm doing a bath time to relax my legs, to relax myself too. But also because I want to use a hammam glove, so I just need my skin to be a little bit soak and like soft before I remove all the dead skin. My nose has a lot of blackheads, it's kind of gross. I haven't done like a deep cleaning on my face, so I'm gonna go in with the carbonated bubble clay mask. This is something that I've been wanting to try for years. <laughs> it's exactly how I imagined this bubble mask would look like over here. I love it. <laughs> From looking cute, bubbly, to looking terrifying. Why do I look like I'm melting away? 
Oh, what a fail. Welcome to my shower. All right, here's the Haman glove. This is a new Haman glove that I just bought from Natural Elephant. When I need to do like a deep, deep exfoliation, this is the stuff that I love to use. Right now, I'm not seeing any dead skin. All I'm seeing is red skin. Oh, I'm seeing it. Eh. Girl, you see all that stuff? <gasps> that is last winter. I'm still gonna exfoliate more. Now I'm gonna go in with Tree Hot Vitamin C. Love how my skin looks after it's so bright. So I'm just gonna grab a good amount because I love it. This sugar scrub also has alpha hydroxyl acid, which is a chemical exfoliator, and I like to use it on my armpits before I shave so that I prevent ingrown hairs. Look at the brightness on my skin. This is what I'm talking about. When I'm going to Target to shop for like self-care products, my husband always drops me off and like picks me up three hours later. Cause that's who I am. I love to shop in Target. I'm a water person. I don't know why I said that. My feet are so crusty that when I'm on the bed and they touch my sheets, they make sounds. That's how bad and nasty my feet is. So I'm gonna use this foot file. Ah, tickles. That's a lot of stuff in there that I was just like saving it for later. Since I was in high school, school started on Monday. So every Sunday, I'll take that time to glow up myself a little bit. My mom used to tease me because every Sunday, she'll open the door. She'll come in and I'll have like an egg face mask. And I'll be like so dry. You just dry? That was a good thing about my mom. She never like made me feel bad about like wasting her eggs. Look at all the dead skin. Don't ask me how long I've been in this shower, okay? So now I'm gonna shave, so I'm gonna go in with Gillette Venus. This is the extra smooth. It is for sensitive skin. And now you pull it. And for shaving, I'm also using EOS. This is the citrus pink, and it smells so delicious. I got razor burn after using the magic eraser. I couldn't shave for a while because my skin was in such a bad shape. I'm so glad I didn't use that on some other areas of my skin. Look at that. Yes. I love to shave when my skin is this exfoliated. Everything glides so smoothly. It's like beautiful. What else? Next, I'm gonna remove the hair mask. Yeah, I hope everything is okay. Wow, my hair feels incredible. It's so silky. And for body wash, I'm gonna go in with a Vino Daily Moisturizing. This version, it does have a little bit of fragrance, and I'm gonna wash with this African Net. I got this because I saw it on TikTok and I was like so curious about like how does it feel. This thing is incredible. The material dries out so fast, which is really good because it's not gonna harvest bacteria. If you have like a hard time reaching your back, you can just use this and like scrub your back like this. It makes your body washes to last you because you don't need to add a lot of body wash for this thing to do this much lather. Finally, I'm out of the shower. I feel so accomplished already now that I have no armpit hair. For back to shower, I'm just gonna show you real quick what I do. What I'm gonna do next is to remove my facial hair and also block some eyebrows. Mustache time. Like April Lavigne says, I'm losing my grip. 
I don't know where my eyebrow scissors are, so I'm gonna have to use my hair scissors. No. Looks good. I'm getting tired. Ooh. You wanna look at the glow of my skin? Feeling like myself. I'm still gonna do a few more things. I wanted to do something for my hair. So I'm gonna wait for my hair to get 80% dry. I'm also still need to do my nails. So I'm just gonna put on some clothes. <laughs> yeah. Probably gonna eat and then I'll come back. I ate some sushi and I crashed. <laughs> also realized that I fell asleep with wet hair. I'm going to do my hair now and I got these rollers. This is from Conair. Last time I did rollers on my hair, it was like a long time ago and I remember taking them off and ripping my hair. Things are not going my way, I feel like it might happen. You're supposed to put the stuff here and then roll it and this is when you curl. Secure. I'm down in the process too. Okay, it's so difficult to put rollers on such a long haired. Was it supposed to be like this? I feel like the answer is no. Yes. I'm gonna use this heat protection. I should have done it before, right? <laughs> okay, once I click this on, I'm ready to go out of earth. I'm gonna connect this thing to the hair dryer. I'm gonna turn it on. So I did that for like 10 minutes. In some moments I was putting some heat, in other moments I was putting some cold air, and at the end I put some cold air. Now I'm just gonna let them stay right here until I'm done so that my hair curls or whatever. For my nails, I'm gonna try it on these reusable press on nails. When I saw them at the store, I was like, these are so pretty, so perfect for summer. It drives me crazy to have uneven nail sizes. I just can't. So I'm gonna trim them. I ordered a very cute dress on Cider, but it didn't fit me. So I got this Fashion Nova dress. This is the dress that I wanted to wear. It's very cute. I'm also gonna pair them with this really cute sandal. So I'm gonna put this on. Look how cute my nails matches with the dress. Now let's take the rollers. So instead of pulling the roller, which is gonna like probably pull a lot of hair and rip up some hair, what you gotta do is twist the hair while you undoing the roller. Oh. So it doesn't like cause tension or like pulls your hair. Oh wow, that is so true. Same old same. I'm done with them. Yeah, there's no hair left in there, so. Uh, I mean, I need to practice obviously. I like the, the waviness that I got on my hair. I'm gonna wear this limb plumper. How does it look? 
feel very pretty, feel much better than yesterday. The only thing that I do regret is my hair. I feel like the rollers make my hair very puffy. My technique probably wasn't good or the rollers are not for me, but it's okay. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you did, don't forget to share some love to me by subscribing to this channel right here. Thank you so much for watching and I hope I'll get to see you in the next video. Pura vida. Bye!